Welcome to Matrix Unlocked, presentation number 39. And I thought I'd look at um, the Great Gate of Kiev. Um, probably more, or more famously known from Mussorgsky's pictures as an exhibition, the music of which is playing in the background. Now this is one of many um, artist impressions and you'll notice the uh, Antiquitec, the domes. It's very curious. This was a, according to this website I've got here, um, the Hartmann's design for the competition of a new gate for Kiev. The goal of the competition was to provide a new gate for better security after an attempt on the Tsar's life. So, as you can see, there's lots of depictions. Um, and we'll come on to this brick one. Um, that's definitely worth looking at. So we'll see what Wiki has to say on this. If we can get it to go back. That's uh, another painting of the Great Gate of Kiev, as it was said to have looked, or open to interpretation. So, good old reliable wiki. The Great Gate of Kiev was the main gate in the 11th century fortifications of Kiev, the capital of Kievian Rus. Interesting they call it Rus. It was named in imitation of the Golden Gate of Constantinople. The structure was dismantled in the Middle Ages, leaving few vestiges of its existence. It was rebuilt completely by the Soviet authorities in 1982, though no images of the original gate have survived. And I, so far, have not been able to find any uh, pictures of this um, 1982 construction um, either. Very interesting. Um, you've got this brick section in the middle that looks far older in style than 1982. I would suggest that they've possibly just added these um, wooden pieces on the side. And it does look to be a mud flooder as well because this arch at the bottom here, um, you can get the arrow to come over, seems proportionally small and then you've got these steps so have a look at the uh, that's another painting of what the original was supposed to have looked like have this interesting view here this is all on wiki in the 1970s prior to, to the reconstruction of the golden gate still retained its traditional shape a shape that has been Remembered for centuries. How very interesting. And here we have another view and you can clearly see the steps and the mud flood influence. But this brick seems very interesting. It does seem strange when there have been paintings and things that they would not have built something that resembled the image in the paintings, but no, they've built, allegedly in 1982, this brick structure to which they've added this strange wooden cladding to it. So, I don't know. You tell me what you think of this one, because something doesn't uh, seem to add up with this at all. So we'll just go back again. And we'll find these images. So you can have a look at the painting once more. Just while we hear the end of this music. So you can, just putting the Great Gate of Kiev on a search. And then you'll get all these, you can look at the images and find all this. Certainly the paintings and things seem to be consistent. 
but this one I thought was particularly interesting for the amount of detail in it. And another view of the supposed 1982 reconstruction. <laughs> 